What's going on, guys? Marcus Zari here, and we're going to talk about the coin on coinmarketcap.com, my favorite website, right? We all love coinmarketcap. I'm going to get this, this thing working. So I'm going to go ahead and refresh the page because I was actually um, doing some research and things like that. Keep my eyes on the markets and things like that matter because it's very, very important. Even though you guys haven't seen my videos, I've been behind the scenes just doing research and things like that matter. I'm just trying to get better, get more educated and things like that so I can, you know, make this cryptocurrency space a better environment for everyone. And the market cap right here is at $463 billion. Um, the market cap is actually climbing. Um, today, earlier, the market cap was at $450 billion and it's at definitely up, you know, $12 billion. So definitely something's going on in the market. But is that... Where's the market going though? For me, in my opinion, I think everybody's getting into Bitcoin right now. Uh, Bitcoin is at eleven thousand dollars and two hundred sixty-two dollars, and I say that because a lot of these altcoins is actually dropping in volume right here. As you guys can see here, there's definitely I want to call it the Red Sea. Um, this is what I call the Red Sea when I see all these different altcoins. Um, you know, um, you know, row by row, you know, um, it's all in the reds, right? Things is definitely down. So I see a lot of that right now. So what's going on? So once I see that, I'm like, to myself, I'm thinking like, okay, when I see all the altcoins, people is either selling their altcoins and things like that. Something's going on to call these altcoins to, you know, to drop in volume and things like that. Uh, not all altcoins, as you guys can see here, some of them, Komodo, um, ARK, 8Share, um, Basic Attention, which is a good cryptocurrency, and Ardor um, is actually up, you know they're in the green so for me what the reason why I'm saying that people is probably either going to Bitcoin because when I click on this 24 hour volume a lot of the volume within the last 24 hours is going into Bitcoin and tether so something is going up um, something is going on um, I don't know what it is a lot of people is going to tether because they're not sure what the market is going to do um, because it's kind of like on the borderline and things like that. So people's holding up in tether and let these altcoins fall so they get get these altcoins at a cheaper price, right? Anything that you know a, a, a smart person will do. So definitely a lot of people is, is hiding out. Um, a lot of people is getting into Bitcoin as well. And a lot of and people is probably getting into Bitcoin because they probably sense a bull run with Bitcoin, which can possibly happen or not happen. Um, definitely this is a new month. Um, we are in the month of March. So um, the month of February was pretty much like a rebound month. Um, January was a month when all everything hit the fan, everything was going down, right? All the FUD, all the regulations and things like that. It just, you know, it was back to back. It's just all different type of stuff that was going on in the market. It just caused a big sell off in the market, which the market actually got as low as when I want to say about two hundred eighty billion dollars. So uh, a big sell off. But now as we fast forward, which is here in the uh, in March, uh, the market definitely came back and brought about two hundred billion dollars back with it as well because we're currently at, um, sitting at four hundred sixty three billion dollars. So to put some things into perspective, um, you know, things are looking good. Right. Um, last month, February, it was a rebound month. Um, things definitely um, went up. Um, things was an opportunity to make money based on that big sell-off in January and a lot of people did um, if you didn't you know there's always opportunity there's always the next boat or the next um, thing to catch catch on if you are paying attention and right now if you're paying attention these altcoins are cheap right now um, nobody can argue that um, these altcoins are cheap you know are all of them cheap no all of them isn't cheap um, are some of them cheap some good ones that are cheap yes absolutely um, you know um, definitely do your own research, you know, do your own due diligence. You know, I'm not a financial advisor, you know, always, you know, be held accountable for your trades and your actions, things like that. But I do see opportunities um, with these altcoins because they're getting cheaper right now. Uh, will I buy them right now? Not per se. I would just wait for me personally. I'm just waiting and just to see how things move. But definitely uh, what I'm seeing, uh, market cap is going up. Uh, the Bitcoin uh, dominance is going up slightly. Uh, Bitcoin is, is number one as far as volume. 
Tether is ranked second. So, um, and everything else is pretty much, you know, don't have that much volume. So that just shows me where the market is, is at. And there's about $2.1 um, $2 billion um, in, you know, Tether right now. That's just, you know, on the sidelines. That's just part and just ready to re-enter the markets once the uncertainty get out the market. So, yeah, with that said, my name is Marcus R. Um, you know, glad to be back. Glad to make another video and things like that. Definitely going to get these videos going. I got that internet situation figured out. Um, so, yeah, give this video a thumbs up. Give this video a thumbs down. All feedback is good feedback. And have a good one, guys.